you have a difficult conversation with your teenager. If you need to have a tricky conversation, firstly plan ahead so the conversation doesn't turn into an argument. Work out when you'll talk to them, when you're both calm and how you're going to stay respectful and calm when you talk. Think about the best outcome to the conversation and then think how you'll approach the conversation to make sure that you get what you want. Work out how you can describe the problem in a neutral way without blaming them. Like I noticed that you didn't enjoy going to see Granny this weekend. I was surprised by some of the things you said. Or I feel annoyed when I walk into the kitchen and everything you've used to make your lunch is still out. Then wait until a good moment and go into their bedroom, sit down and say, there's something that's been bothering me. Would now be a good time to chat about it? If they say no, ask when. If they say yes, then secondly, when you have the conversation, explain the problem, ask for their side and then explain your side. So explain why you want to talk to them in a neutral way so you don't get their back up. Then ask how they feel about it. While your teenager's talking, don't interrupt, just listen. And at the end, try to summarize what they've said and check that you've understood. So you felt resentful that we went to see Granny instead of seeing your friends. And you thought she was a bit critical. When your teenager feels understood, they'll be much more able to listen when you say, is it okay if I explain my side now? Then tell them how you feel. Granny's really lonely and she's old. She's my mum and I love her. And I felt really sad when you said, I wish we hadn't bothered coming. So you explain your side. Finally, try to find a solution you're both happy with. Think of lots of different ways to sort it out. Really, the longest time should be spent on this bit, finding a way to solve the problem, where you try to find ways that you both get what you want. You can still be quite firm here. If they're promising to do something, ask how they'll remember without being reminded and what they'll do to make it up if they don't do it. So when there's an important problem you need to talk to your teenager about, three tips are plan ahead. When you have the conversation, explain the problem, ask for their side and then explain your side. And try to find a solution that you're both happy with. If you found this useful, visit my website www.parentforsuccess.com and sign up for my video tips for raising teenagers and you'll get the latest video blog sent straight to your inbox. Thank you.